When the researchers woke, they realized the Prothean species was doomed. There were only a dozen individuals left, far too few to sustain a viable population. Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning, a way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. The Keepers? Are they under the influence of the Reapers? The Keepers are controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the Keepers to activate the Citadel relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. Using the conduit, they gained access to the Citadel and made the modifications. This time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. How can they come back? Saren must have some plan to undo everything you did. The one you call Saren will use the conduit to bypass the Citadel's defenses. Once inside, he will transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Sovereign will override the Citadel systems and manually open the relay. And the cycle of extinction will begin again. Can you help me? Is there any way we can stop them? There's a data file in my console. Take a copy when you go. When you reach the Citadel's master control unit, upload it to the station. It will corrupt the Citadel's security protocols and give you temporary control of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait, where's the Citadel's master control unit? I've never heard of anything like that. Through the conduit, follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. Let's go. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. The one you call Saren has not reached the conduit. Not yet. There is still hope if you hurry. Hey look, we leveled up. We are 52. Um... Yeah, fuck it. So, uh, lots of information. Damn it. Lots of information. Up the elevator we go! It's tragic. For all their great achievements, the Protheans lost everything. Just like my people. Even their last plan failed. Keep it moving. I've got no intention of ending up like them. I agree, Rex. The only answer. Straight ahead. It's really easy to flip your Mako and do some crazy shit in this area, by the way. Um, if you like that, if you're not a uh, adept at controlling the Mako by now, uh, this could be a really frustrating uh, descent to the conduit. It could be a really frustrating descent regardless, uh, depending on difficulty and, um... Things like that. Get rid of these fucking assholes. Wow, you missed! You're so... so good at this game. 
What is it doing? What are you doing, sir? Yeah. Okay. We're gonna save here because... Yeah. Oh god, that, that sounded awful. Uh, I've actually found most of my Mako glitches uh, in this uh, section of the game. Like, um, falling through the map and shit like that. Or flying through the map. Um, I've actually got a screenshot of when I because I started taking screenshot of, screenshots of like buggy shit uh, last year. Uh, uh, and I have a screenshot of uh, last year's run when I uh, was doing the mission to get Liara and my uh, my vehicle had been hit by the armament right as I was like running into a rock and it like exploded me into the air. Oh fuck. Um, yeah, so that was cool. So there's the conduit. The conduit. It's incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. We have to get through that relay and these Geth aren't going to make it easy on us. Uh. It has begun. So we have 40 seconds to, to get down to the conduit, uh, and this is why this mission can be frustrating, because look at all that bumpy ground and all those colossus. Um, and the Mako doesn't do well on bumpy ground, the Mako's an asshole on bumpy ground. I managed to deal with it though, which was really nice. Typically I fuck up and like flip right off to the left or right, which is terrible, just awful, and you don't want that to happen. Critical fickle failures detected across all monitored systems. Please begin emergency evacuation. Surprise, motherfucker! Oh, that was too early. Damn it! Surprise, motherfucker! <laughs> I ruined it! Fuck. Now that's how you enter the goddamn citadel. Critical failures detected across all monitored No. 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 You go away. You go away right now and you die. Hello, Avina. The Presidium is experiencing severe system malfunctions across the entire level. All non-emergency personnel must evacuate immediately. Status report. Give me a rundown of the damage. 
We have lost all primary power to the level. What's going on with you, Avina? Class 3 fires are burning in sectors 2, 3, 6, and 7. Civilian casualties are high. I am also You're backwards. Avina, Avina. Calm down. They are believed to it's be going to be okay. Please approach with caution. Come on. We need to stop Saren before it's too late. Please begin emergency evacuation procedures. This is not a drill. Look at that hole in the wall. That is a nice hole in the wall. We're going up to the Citadel Tower. See, this door is closed all the way. Uh, he just shot the keepers. You asshole! Why would you do such a thing? So, uh, if you don't know, the very basic looking ships, um, are the Turian ships, like the, the blocky ships. The, the funny oval looking ships are, sorry. Uh, I'm not sure if we'll start Mass Effect 2 tomorrow. Uh, we will be starting it at the very latest, um, the day after tomorrow. Uh, but I'm not sure if we'll be starting it tomorrow. It depends on if I, uh, if I'm feeling it like right away tomorrow. Uh, but I, at most there will be like a daybreak um, in between the two. awful. <laughs> that helmet does look a little bad, but uh, I like it anyway. Because it's red. I don't actually know which way I, oh, I am going this way. Okay. Good. But yeah, I, I don't know what I want to do tomorrow. Because, uh... I've kind of been feeling like uh, wanting to play a platformer. So we might do like... Like a... A Donkey Kong Country tomorrow. In between the two games. Uh, Or Super Meat Boy or something, I don't know. Um, why is there a Krogan? I don't want a Krogan. Tell the Krogan to go away. Tell the Krogan to go away! Get your face off my face! You dickhead! Jesus!
Got him. This fucking asshole. Am I going this way? Uh, I actually have no idea where I'm going. Now that's perfect. Directions not clear. Ended up on Earth. Hmm? Uh, it's because I'm using. God damn it. I'm using, uh, the, uh, this one. The Spectre shotgun. Which has a 90 accuracy rating. Um, it also has the highest damage output. I made sure to invest the 266,000, uh, what's your fuck, in, in that shotgun. Uh, because I knew I was going to be using shotgun Cicerone. Uh, and there's nothing better. Uh, guaranteed. supposed to be doing? I see the mount button, but where is the mount? Where? Here? Oh, it's for cla- God damn it. I'm an idiot. Um... Uh, well, that goes down. Um... I'm missing something here. And I, I see it now. God damn it. I'm so good at this at this game. Uh, but yeah. This is it's even more accurate when you actually iron sight. So you get to take full advantage of its accuracy. Um, It's a fantastic shotgun. Oh. Yeah. And I don't even think there's a snipe, like an assault rifle that comes close to matching my shotgun. Uh, it's that fucking powerful. <laughs> So this is more or less a, a tower defense, which is kind of funny. Uh, not the standard tower defense as we know it though. I'm defending... Uh, well, I guess it is... This. No, never mind. I was thinking like turret defense, which it, it isn't a standard turret defense, but it is a, a tower defense. Because we aren't using the turrets, but the turrets are our towers. So, yeah. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Use your skills. God damn it. Stop. Stop it. Oh, that one was hacked. And away we go. But yeah, I've been using the shotgun most of the run. Um, since, uh... After Liara's mission. So... Yeah. Most of the run. Uh, Story-wise, anyway. 
Gameplay wise, I've had it for about half the game now. Um, oh, the destroyer's on our side. No, it's not. It's hacked, but it's still charging me. You bastard. Fucking Krogan. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I don't want to deal with Destroyer, the Juggernaut. <laughs> I like how easily that, that like fits. No, 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 Rex doesn't have a charge. He has stasis, which doesn't really help right now. Because um, we're not really fighting them in large groups. Um, and he has barrier. So, I mean... He doesn't have throw. And throw isn't what you're thinking. Uh, but he's using his barrier and his immunity himself, so I don't, I don't need to use those. He's doing it. Uh, ow! Fuck! 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 Get that down. Yeah, charge is an ME2, ME3 skill. Um, oh my god, Th this is a terrible idea. Never, never do this. Unless you're... Well, actually, this is a good idea. Never mind. Always do this. <laughs> Always be standing in their face. Something's shooting at me. Well, now I see this guy. This fucking asshole. Hey buddy. How's it going? This is actually one of my favorite scenes of the game because of uh, like how epic it is. Charging along the sides of the citadel. To get to uh, to Saren. Unfortunately. Uh, well, no, we're, we're right here. What we'll, we'll do it. Uh, I was gonna say it is break time, but we're we're so close that I want to ride it out. Because uh, that's such a dick move to like get right up to the end and be like, ah, time for that break. Because that's exactly what you want to hear when you're like. Right at the end of your, your television show or your movie. God, I hate television. But I have the choice and I choose not to do that. Oh fuck. This was a terrible decision. Alright, now it's a good decision. I've lost shields. Maybe. We got him!
I was afraid you wouldn't make it in time, Shepard. In time? In time for what? The final confrontation. I think we both expected it would end like this. You've lost. You know that, don't you? In a few minutes, Sovereign will have full control of all the Citadel systems. The relay will open. The Reapers will return. I can stop them. I've still got a few tricks up my sleeve. You survived our encounter on Vermeer. But I've changed since then. Improved. Sovereign has upgraded me. What have you done? You let Sovereign implant you? Are you insane? I suppose I should thank you, Shepard. After Vermeer, I couldn't stop thinking about what you said. About Sovereign manipulating me. About indoctrination. The doubts began to eat away at me. Sovereign sensed my hesitation. I was implanted to strengthen my resolve. Now my doubts are gone. I believe in Sovereign completely. I understand that the Reapers need organics. Join us, and Sovereign will find a place for you, too. You're indoctrinated! Sovereign's controlling you through your implant! Don't yeah, this, this whole fucking mission is epic, the but yeah. The relationship is symbiotic. Uh. Organic and machine intertwined. A union of flesh and steel. The strength of It's a great end to the game. I am a vision of the future, Shepard. The evolution of all organic life. This is our destiny. Join Sovereign and experience a true rebirth. We can beat them! Sovereign hasn't won yet. I can stop it from taking control of the station. Step aside and the invasion will never happen. We can't stop it. Not forever. You saw the visions. You saw what happened to the Protheans. The Reapers are too powerful. Don't give in to them. Fight! Some part of you must still realize this is wrong. You can fight this. Maybe you're right. Maybe there is still a chance for... The implants. Sovereign is too strong. I'm sorry. It is too late for me. That's not true. It's impossible. That that doesn't fit here. I'm sorry. But it's not over yet. You can still redeem yourself. Goodbye, Shepard. Thank you. Oh shit, son! He done killed himself.